Good afternoon once again. It has long been rumored and now there is evidence to back up the claim that bottled water might not be so good for you after all. A new study just out. It shows there's a lot more than just water inside those plastic bottles. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Josh Bazan is on the story for us tonight. It's, it's just that we need to re-examine our relationship with this material. Dr. Sherry Mason is a chemistry professor at SUNY Fredonia. She just completed a study on bottled water from around the world, and what she found may surprise a lot of people. 93% of the bottles looked at in this study had plastic in the water. On average, every liter of bottled water had 10 plastic particles big enough to see with the naked eye, and 325 total pieces of plastic. Mason says those small pieces are important to be aware of. But they're more concerning when it comes to the science because, of course, those are the particles that can make their way across your gastrointestinal tract, be translocated throughout your body, and end up in your, your various organs. Mason and her team looked at 259 bottles from 11 brands purchased in nine countries, among them popular brands such as Aquafina, Dasani, and Nestle Pure Life. What was interesting in this study is the vast majority of the plastics that we found in the bottled water were actually fragments. And um, this leads really good kind of supporting evidence that the plastic is actually making its way into the bottle through the process of bottling the water. You know, I think that we have enough evidence to, to support you know, us kind of rethinking our dependence on the single use disposable plastic. To be clear, the study didn't look at the health impact of putting these microplastics into your body. The International Bottled Water Association says the research isn't accurate and tells customers bottled water is regulated by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration and is safe to drink. In Buffalo, Josh Bazan, 7 Eyewitness News.